Should you trade on Fed Day? That is the question that always comes up. And to me, the answer is yes. Look at this nice trend in the stock index's gap continuation. A little choppy in here. So if you, you get in at these highs, you might get stopped out. Some of our trades were stopped out on some pullbacks. But overall, uh, our total results on the day up $7,200 on the All Strategy Access for trades in the stock index portfolio. I want to show you those now. So if 912.50 on Cobra 3 Mini S&P, minus 625 on Cobra 3 NQ. That was one of the losing trades. It was stopped out. And then we had Gap Continuation 2020. That was also stopped out down here, minus 325. But on the winning side, we had Adaptive Moving Average, plus 925. It started on the short side, got in on the long side, just rode the trend all day long. Requires some patience to do that sitting through news events, uh, Fed, FOMC, uh, press conferences, and you know the uh, tech, top tech CEOs testified today uh, on the Hill. And so plus 475 on stock index wing, it's one that takes profit targets early. So one, two, three, four, five strategies that traded in this workspace. Three out of five were winners overall net gain in this workspace. Then we take a look at uh, All Strategy Access 2 plus 1250 on AT2019, plus 1285 on AT2020 NQ, uh, tick pullback plus 1800. Really nice entry on tick pullback and really nice gain today to trading that strategy on the E-mini NASDAQ. And this, this is one of the strategies of the day as well. These two are the strategies of the day buying the dips. So these are some of the most perfect entries that you could ask for on a day like today. This strategy does not always catch perfect entries, does not always win, but today it was spot on and it went three for three, and it's hard to do much better than that. And so that, that along with the tick pullback were the strategies of the day in the stock index futures. And so yes, we trade on Fed days and we've had some choppy price action lately. And you see this choppy price action. And then on Fed Day, it's just pretty smooth compared to the last three days. And so Thursday, last Thursday, Friday, um, Monday, Tuesday were pretty choppy. Today, straight up. So nice trend today. Over 7K in the stock index strategies. All Strategy Access 3. Had a disconnection here on my desktop. This is my desktop. I have a platform on my desktop and a VPS. And so you see some of these updates happening here. I'm going to pause the video until those are done. So all the data is reloaded now. And up and down day in the uh, other markets. Uh, Gold Flash plus 375 had its ups and downs. Asia Gold 4 was a winner on the day plus 1475. Cobra Euro 4 minus 625. Euro continues higher. Strong trend higher. Um, very choppy trend. SR Counter Trend Gold 2 captured the low of the day, near the low, plus 475. SR Counter Trend 2 Silver, minus 825. And those were the trades in this workspace, All Strategy Access 3, All Strategy Access 4. SR Counter Trend 3 Gold A, plus 475. SR Counter Trend 3 Gold B, minus 825. Asia Gold 4 just stopped out on the lows. Very volatile gold market. It's, uh, it's been challenging to trade gold. You see all these ups and downs. Uh, there's a lot of selling at that 2000 level up here. Uh, the sellers are stepping in, and so you get these massive moves, and then you get this down move, and then this up move, and the down move. And so this pullback here, this bar right here is, how big of a bar was that? That was, uh, I think, $30 in that, that move, 1998.40. 1969, 60, almost $30 move in that one hour time frame late in the day, you know, during FOMC. And so, big move. Gold Flash caught some of the trades on that. But so, while the trend is up, there is some distribution and selling as it approaches 2000. So, kind of a bumpy ride if you're trading gold. Uh, Cobra Gold short uh, plus 575 on the day. Uh, All Strategy Access 5, we had um, minus 825 across the board on the SR counter trend, 1M, 5M, and 15M. And so some good trades in the other workspaces in gold. This one, 
uh, three losses on this one. Uh, All Strategy Access 6, we just sent out an update on this if you have this. Uh, if you had traded the larger stop loss Cobra 3 with $2,500 stop loss, it was up on the day. This is not officially part of the portfolio. It's one of the strategies we're watching, and it's in the portfolio calculator. Uh, ES After Hours plus 75, and those are there. There were no other trades in this workspace on the day, and so just it's just interesting to see how much smoother the trend is today on a Fed day versus you know what we've seen uh, the last five days before this. So last since last Thursday, it's been very choppy. And then we get this Fed day where, you know, everyone used to get nervous, don't trade on the Fed, don't trade on the Fed. But uh, counterintuitive, nice trend higher. Um, and so I would anticipate uh, this market. Let's, let's look at the market internals as well. I want to go over this. One thing that you could use to guide your way today was after 1045, the advanced decline line climbed higher. So it was a, if you use this as your guide for the trend and the VIX pretty much straight down uh, you could buy the dips more easily if you're watching that and so that's what happened a lot of dips a lot of a lot of uh, I mean you just see how how this is kind of choppy but not choppy enough to um, to get rid of the trend you can still you can still see the trend and the trend is higher and our trend strategy still captured it even though it was a little bit of a choppy trend um, it was smoother it was upward and smoother than what we've had the last four or five days and so you see the NQ just uh, oftentimes you'll see that happen the futures close here and then the trend gets even smoother and so we've had four or five days of chop we have an uptrend the future the, the stock market closes at four but the futures keep trading is what I'm saying and then an even smoother trend and so what oftentimes what this will do is this will kick off a stronger rally to the upside so look for a strong rally to the upside overnight barring any uh, major news events.